Hey everybody, MTB, Mary and the Barbarian here. Um, I didn't get to do a shave Sunday night. Um, I did Monday morning in the shower as a quickie. And actually I got such a BBS shave, I didn't need to shave until today, Tuesday. Um, so I missed out on Maddie Monday and I didn't do Sunday. And Maddie, I am sorry. Um, I was gonna try to do it last night, but I passed out eating. Um, watching stupid anime attack on titan um i guess y'all have all seen that people are doing these videos and you know it's just really let maddie know that we really do stand behind him and if he needs anything please reach out let us know and we're sorry for your loss and i know saying all that doesn't really help been through stuff myself and you know people always say it and i guess it does help but there's nothing anybody can really do for you when you're dealing with emotional stuff so all the mushy stuff off to the side and sad stuff we're going to get to the shave today. I'm going to use Maddie soap. Um, it's not in the picture because I just keep the puck. And we're moving along on this puck, guys. Um, I do use it sometimes quick in the shower and stuff like that. I don't use a brush. I just put it on like shave stick and lather. And residual slickness gets me to a good shave. So, what are we going to use? We are using the Maddie Lynn Home Brush. I do like this brush quite a bit. I couldn't find my short one I have that's a little weighted. It looks the same as this, but this part came off when he was turning it, and I thought that was really cool because Maddie just figures stuff out like that. It's pretty amazing, actually. <laughs> um, you know, improvise, make work, adjust, overcome type thing. So that's why I wanted that one. He doesn't have a lot of them because it's when that happens that he makes them, he doesn't just make them. So we're going to try to put a little bit more water on my brush. I'm just going to load it up like this. We're going to do a two pass shave because even though you see some stubble, it's really not great guys. Like I got a really close shave Monday morning. Yeah. Before work, I used the supply razor. That thing's really nice. It's kind of forgiving, too. I'm going to rinse the puck off. Or... You know what, guys? I may have lathered too long. Cause Maddie's soap is a thirsty soap. It can hold it can hold some water, which is a good thing, in my opinion. But teach their own. We are using warm water today. You don't normally see me use warm water. It's chilly AF outside today. So, hang it on. Do a little bit of face lather. I always face lather with Maddie's soaps. There's been a few times I cut a little piece off, put it in the bottom of the bowl, but I prefer to use it as a shave stick normally, but I don't have a lot of grain, so I just didn't want to, you know, not a lot of growth, so I didn't want to count on a, my lack of beard growth loading, you know? But we're just gonna paint this on, get it there. Oh yeah. Getting there, aren't we guys? I think we're getting there. About time to splay, wouldn't you say? Oh, I didn't tell you, this is the lemon lime. It's really my favorite. It's the one I keep out the most. I do enjoy the orange. Actually, I think I burned through the orange already. So. And if y'all don't know, um, his scent black Asa spirit, his wife created, and her name is Asa. I'm sorry, Asa, Maddie, if I uh, pronounced that wrong. I'm not good at pronouncing Swedish. Always tend to fudge it up. Although, I will get the name of this razor right. That much I can guarantee.
Oh my God, guys. More water. I overloaded. I feel super dense. I may just go with it. I'm sure I'm going to have plenty of slickness. We're going to go with it. Slightly under hydrated lather. I got some bubbles in there still, but I see to lather. Let me dry the hands. Because now, the star of this show, CV Helia Strand, number 24. Four eights. I think, what is that, a French point? So, super excited about that. It's got a tiny little tang. This was a gift from Maddie. Um, still has Maddie's edge, I believe. Don't think I sent this off. So, Maddie puts a nice edge on a razor. And he does a good job restoring stuff like, like this razor. I don't know what shape it was when he got it. But as a friend, he restored some stuff for me and he didn't charge me anything. And Maddie, if I haven't told you, thank you. Because, you know, you've been... See the irritation from the overshaving in the shower? It wasn't the soap. I mean, I had so much slickness. I didn't even feel the blade on the razor. It was just gliding really well. Got into the shave, lost where it was. In conversation. Monologue really, right? So if y'all don't know, in a way y'all have met Maddie's wife, if you watch his videos, there are some videos that someone is filming him and you can tell, and guess who that is? Awesome. And he sent me some personal videos. You know, showing what he was doing and stuff when we were first talking about soaps and what he'd be sending me and how he does it and all this stuff. I will admit, guys, when I got this razor in my hand, so thank you, Maddie. Shaving was a lot easier with this. I, I don't know why. Maybe it was the edge. Maybe it was because it was a gift and I was so excited and I don't know, built up some placebo effect, but I really started doing better in my straight razor shaves when this came into my den. So... Really nice. I enjoy it. It's a great edge. It's when I found out that I don't need a big razor to get a good shave. I mean, you can watch Maddie and pretty much find that out without having to experience it for yourself. But once you experience it, I mean, you can have things you prefer, but you don't need a huge blade to get a good shave. I'm not trying to trigger anybody. So please. Don't want to hear how 
I'm wrong. I just started some shit in the straight razor world, but anyways. Just a personal opinion. It really doesn't matter on size. For straight razors, thick size matters. Alright. <laughs> so we're gonna give it a go. And we're gonna see if I can do it this way. I'm not a non-dominant hand guy. Maddie's not either, but I'm trying to switch things up, learn different techniques. I don't like the buffing strokes. There we go. That was nice. I have a hard time going against the grain on the chin, and that worked out rather nicely in my opinion. Need to stop trying to do. Go back to. I can tell you my non-dominant hand touches lighter. Because I'm scared as hell to uh, come in too steep. Did I hit my is that a memory line? Huh, maybe. I don't know if I did it now or it's from something else, but I do just see it in the mirror. If it opens up, we'll say I did it now, okay? The way the light was reflecting off the window. There we go! Must have done it now. Didn't really feel it. I don't think I did. Yeah, who cares? You bleed to know your life. Sorry, it's a song from when I was a kid, high school. And Okay, we're done. No touch-ups today. Like I said, a little over shaving Monday morning. It was a great shave though. Was impressed with the closeness, but there was some over shaving going on. So we got a memory line. Alright. So I'm gonna rinse. We'll come right back. Alrighty, people. We are back. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna. My uh, cube is slowly falling apart. Let my cube, my uh, alum block. So we're gonna wet it, wet my face. See if we can seal up this memory line. Not really much burn, guys. Not bad. So, back in the dry dock, slight dabbing, no rinsing, had some water on there so we're going to dab it. And what do we follow it up with? Haga Original, uh, toxic waste, as Maddie says. I have the Uppsala, but I think this one is the one that's uh, Maddie's favorite. I like the Uppsala, but... 
Cabati, we're going to use the original today. It's a good set, don't get me wrong, but if you pick them between the two, I like the blue. Maybe it's because I like the color blue. So guys, again, Maddie, we're sorry for you and Asa's loss and your family's loss. And uh, just know that you're in, you're in my thoughts. And again, if you ever need anything, please don't hesitate to let me know. And guys, that was a really nice shave. I will admit, I had irritation going into this one, like all down here. It went rather well, other than my memory line. Self-inflicted wounds, man. So, guys, really awesome brush. If anyone's interested, I actually have a few of these in stock. I'm not trying to shill or anything. Just, I actually do, and people have been reaching out since people have been doing videos about Matty Soaps. And, guys, I'm out of Matty Soaps. Um, I do have an order coming in. They're in tubs, so price went up. Less When I get a price is when they'll come in like when they come in I'll make sure I have a price and once I've paid for everything I'll be able to really know what needs to be charged um, and as always not trying to make a lot of money off this just trying to you know share the awesome soaps so guys until next time y'all have a great day